Well, Susie, Simi Valley police here say the arrest of the Golden State Killer gives them hope that even after 40 years, a brutal double murder may be solved. It's within the realm of possibility that he could be a suspect in our case. Simi Valley police are now trying to find out if the accused Golden State Killer is the killer in one of their biggest cold cases. Did Joseph D'Angelo murder a young mother and her son in their apartment back in 1978? You had the same time period that he was committing crimes throughout the state. You had our homicide occur. Also, he is suspected of committing a homicide in Ventura County. We're part of Ventura County. Investigators are waiting to see if the DNA that helped identify D'Angelo as the Golden State Killer will also tie him to the murders of Rhonda Wick and her four-year-old son. We've made a request for a DNA comparison to find out if the DNA that they've recovered from uh, Mr. D'Angelo is consistent with the DNA that we have in our case. 70-year-old Craig Coley is also waiting for the results of the DNA test. He was released from state prison in November after spending nearly 40 years for the murders of Wick and her son, a crime he never committed. He was her ex-boyfriend and was wrongly convicted for their murders because introducing DNA evidence was impossible back then and evidence used at trial was faulty. Detectives got the samples reanalyzed with modern DNA technology and found that it wasn't Coley's DNA. We spoke with him over the phone tonight. I don't care how they find out as long as they find out and it's a, a true conviction. Coley tells us whether there's a DNA match to the Golden State Killer or to someone else. All he wants is someone held accountable. First of all, I'd feel elated for the family, for Rhonda's family. I believe that at some point in time that they will find who did this and you know, justice will finally be served. Police say they're not sure exactly how long it'll take to get those results back, but in the meantime, they're actively working this case. Back to you in the studio.